Hi, welcome to Digital Service Management Video Rapid. I am Anurag, Solution Engineer for BMC. Today we will look at how does BMC Remedy integrates with Atrium Orchestrator. BMC Remedy has an out-of-the-box adapter for Atrium Orchestrator. In this video, we will look at how the event notification from Remedy is captured by Atrium Orchestrator. Log into your CDP and enable the two adapters of Remedy, the actor and the monitor. Add them to the grid. Once the adapters are added, we are ready to configure them. Give a name to the actor adapter. The description. The host name or the IP address of the BMC AR system application server. The port that it works on. The username that is used to connect to the AR system. The password. The rest of the details can be default. And save it. Let us configure the monitor adapter as well in the same way. Give a name to it. The description. The IP address or the host name of the BMC application server. The username and the password again. With the port of course. And save it. Once the adapters have been configured, we need to enable them. Log into your CDP and let's enable the adapters that exist there. I'll enable all the adapters that are there and save. You can verify the connection status of both the adapters. Now is the time to create a filter to generate an event. Log into your developer studio and create a new filter. In this example, I would use a work order form to create a filter. Select your work order form. The execution options of modify and submit. The run if qualification assigned so that when the work order is in the assigned status, the alert has to be generated. So select the run if qualification as assigned and add the action as notify. The alert, the user that would generate the event and the text that I want to be passed as part of the alert. The work order ID, the status, and let's go ahead and put the summary as well as part of the text event. Save the filter, give a name to it. Work out a trigger. Now that the filter is saved, we are ready to test it by creating a new work order in Smart IT. I would enter the basic details of this work order. For example, email account create, the description, and once I have entered all the fields, I would go ahead and save it. Now that the work order is created and is in the assigned status, log back into your Atrium Orchestrator and open the grid log, and we would see that the alert has been captured by the Atrium Orchestrator adapter. This alert can now be used to trigger workflows inside Atrium Orchestrator. This is how Remedy integrates with the Atrium Orchestrator. That brings us to the close with a fact you don't know. Thank you for watching.